Hi, this is Saev Morton with the daily update on Eurofix. I post my exclusive market overviews with the key political and economical events, charts and important levels on the forexpisami.com forums weekly. This short video is a response to rapidly changing situation on the currency markets and should help you to stand top of the game and be profitable. I suggest you to visit forexpisami.com forum and read my analysis for the week before watching this daily video. guys uh, let's take a look at the gold market as usual on the weekly research we have said uh, approximately about the perspective that we would uh, probably uh, will see on the gold market um, the major problem for uh, let's call it as the reversal to the downside on the gold market and starting the deep retracement stands on the weekly chart because on the weekly chart we have the Polish grubber that suggests the taking out of the 1375 tops. And uh, you can see that slightly above this top stands the monthly pivot resistance one. And here, guys, uh, absolutely two different wave of, of, uh, ways of action could happen. So the, the one uh, story, if market just will move above this top, grab the stops that have been placed about 1380, touch the monthly pivot resistance one, and immediately will drop lower. In this case, we could get not the hand shoulders, guys, but we could get double top pattern because Russian rings of the of by the second top is very typical for double top pattern itself. Also, guys, this scenario is uh, perfectly matched to picture that we have on the monthly chart because on the monthly chart uh, we have the re potential reversal hand shoulders pattern and and, and the neckline stands precisely at an area of 1383 uh, where the monthly pivot resistance 1 stands. Also there is the major 38 resistance. And for that standpoint uh, it, it will be very nice if market will form bearish reversal pattern right at the monthly neckline. And, uh, the, and this bearish reversal pattern could become the double top pattern. This is the one story. Another story if market will break this area move above the weekly pivot resistance 1 and will hold there. That will change everything because in this case we uh, probably will not get uh, the head and shoulders anytime soon or neckline should be adjusted and we will have to watch for another patterns that will point on the possible reversal or something of that sort. So this will be really significantly complicate uh, the analysis on the weekly chart on the, and on the lower time frame charts. At the same time, guys, in the current situation, we can't take the short position. Only, even uh, as we see right now, the gold market right at the top of the potential right shoulder, because we have bearish, uh, bullish engulfing pattern, uh, sorry, bullish uh, stop grabber on the monthly, on the weekly chart. So maybe scalp traders could take some scalp short here with a minor bounce or something on sort of that sort on the 15-minute chart, or just minor reaction could, could happen here. But uh, generally speaking, on the daily chart, although we have head and shoulders, but we have the contradictive up opposite uh, pattern on the high time frame, on the weekly. That's why, guys, in such circumstances, you know, the high time frame overrules lower time frame. That's why, in the current circumstances, the chances that this pattern will fail significantly greater than it will work. Especially by taking a look at the uh, speed and the pace of this upward action that stands on the right shoulder. Here, guys, this shoulder should be uh, flatter and uh, weaker than this action on the head. But we see that action is real, relatively strong. Also, guys, take a look that recently market has tested the weekly monthly pivot point and turns to the upside, and sentiment right now stands bullish. That's why, guys, uh, we think that it's more safe to see what will happen in this area. Because on the other uh, other um, assets, on the currencies, on the forex market, we we'll also see hints on the possible uh, upward continuation, at least to the non-farm payrolls release. Maybe non-farm payrolls will be precisely the moment, the issue that will change the situation, that will push gold market and currencies to the downside. For example, if the non-farm payrolls will be very nice, this could become the, the reason why market could form the double top. So by the impact on the positive non-farm market could move here to this area for example at the eve of the non-farm payrolls release grab the stops when the payrolls will come 
uh, and if the level will be positive, market could drop. And by this action, it could put the foundation of the appearing of the double top action. That's one of the possible scenarios. Anyway, it's better to wait what will happen here. Because this is, will be major moment for short-term perspective on the gold market. So, um, also we do not uh, probably need to take a look at any other charts. Maybe only on the hourly chart. On the 4-hour time frame chart you could see that's nothing really special. So our hand and shoulders pattern stands. It uh, currently stands right at the top of the shoulder, but guys, really action is fast and as I said, appearing of the bullish uh, stop grabber on the weekly charts makes really difficult to take the short position. Also, guys, take a look at the hourly chart. On the hourly chart, market has hit the target that we have specified in our weekly research. This is the uh, target of this double bottom pattern. And uh, we said that uh, we could think about the taking the short position only if market will drop lower and return back below the neckline of this pattern. Other words speaking, as we said, we need to get the bearish reversal swing on the hourly chart. That will bring at least some confidence uh, to um, us that market uh, with with the uh, possible uh, downward action. But currently, guys, it's very risky. So market stands above the weekly pivot point, above the monthly pivot point, um, and having the bullish pattern on the weekly chart makes really not quite reasonable taking the short, despite even on the fact that market stands at the top of the right shoulder. On the hand shoulder special. And you can see right now market is trying to move higher. That's why uh, when you have the up opposite pattern uh, to your trading plan, you need to see that market confirms your idea, that market confirms the idea of the possible downward action. At least this will happen, will not happen. Uh, it's better to not take the short position. And this will happen only if market will drop below the neckline and starting action really with the right shoulder and the hand shoulder special. But something tells me that this probably will not happen. Uh, at least till the Friday. And the currently, guys, in the current situation, taking in the consideration this really this upward fast action, it seems that market still will will clear out these tops. And if even any pattern will be formed, at least some pattern will be formed. Bearish reversal. It probably will be the double top pattern. It's currently, I think so. So, guys, let's keep watching what will happen on the gold market. As you can see, every every time, every day, something new appears, and uh, we need to adjust trading plan uh, almost daily. So let's see what we will get today and then tomorrow.